Hey everyone, it's me, Miss Nelson, and today I am going to show you how to use a magazine or an ad or a newspaper to inspire a fun drawing challenge. So all you need for this is a uh, newspaper ad with a picture that you like. It can be really anything or a magazine ad. These are from magazines or it can be a photo or a picture or a drawing in a magazine. It can even be something from those little inserts in newspapers that you get. Or it could be a page from an old book that you're not going to use anymore, but be sure to get permission before you take pages out of books or out of your parents' magazines. So I am going to um, choose this one. It's a nice big image, which I like, and it's also a puppy dog, which I really like. You'll need a pair of scissors, but if you don't have scissors, you can actually just rip. Um, you'll need just a blank piece of paper, and if it's white, that's good, but if it's a lined paper, that's okay too. And you'll need a glue stick or glue or tape, could work if you don't have either of those, and a pencil or a pen. And then, you know, if you can, if you have something to color with, that would be good too. So I have cut out the picture of the dog, and this is the part that's really hard. Um, for some of us to do. It seems um, like we're destroying the picture, but we're not. So the next thing you're going to do is either cut it in half or rip it in half. So I'm just going to go ahead and cut this in half in an interesting place. Okay. And I'm just going to save part of the drawing. I get to choose which half I want to keep um, because I am going to take that half and then draw the rest. So I think I'll go ahead and choose this half. I'm gonna turn it over, okay? And I am going to drop my glue stick cap, and that's okay. I am going to put um, glue on the back and then press it down. And I'm gonna leave space to draw, okay? You don't wanna put it over here because then you wouldn't be able to finish your drawing. You wanna leave yourself space to draw and you just push it down and then you smooth it out along the paper, okay? And get it glued down. Okay, so a lot of people forget this, but when you have a glue stick, you wanna make sure to turn it so that you don't want it to be like that. You wanna turn the bottom so that the glue is inside of the glue stick so that when you put the cap on, it doesn't get all smushed, okay? And you make sure it snaps. Now, now that I have my picture glued down, I'm just gonna take my pencil and finish the drawing. And it doesn't have to be the same as my other half. I can make this whatever I want to. So I could finish drawing the dog, or I could make him into a dragon dog which is what I think I'll do. So I just find where the lines are, like here's the line for his nose. I'm just gonna continue that. I'm gonna imagine his other ear over here. And I am going to give him some dragon horns, I think. And just kind of, okay, so here's his head right there. Here's a wrinkle, I gotta continue this line here too. So here is his back. So I am going to imagine that he's really quite large and he has a huge wide stance, big claws. But see how I used the line from his back and I just kept going with it. I used the line here and I see here's a leg. So I add a leg over here. So I'm trying to use this picture to start the lines for the rest of my picture. His eye is here, so I'm gonna put his other eye right there. Okay, I'm gonna continue his nose right here. 
and so on and so forth. So I need to finish the bowl there, using those lines to finish the bowl. So I'm just gonna take, I'm gonna use this half and finish it over here. And then I can get creative, you know? What if he's got like spots, like a cow? He's a dra doggy dragon cow, I like him. He is cute. And what if he has like some weird kind of mark? Ah, oh, that looks weird, okay. Like a starburst on his forehead. Yeah, just like that. All right, so, and then I would just color it in and that will be my drawing. So um, you could do anything. You could finish just a random ad. You know, take, this is kind of big. So I could just take part of this and just cut out part of it. Right down his face. That's okay, he doesn't feel it. And turn to the next page in my notebook here glue that down and then just finish the drawing and I don't have to make it funny like the dragon um I can make it however I want to so I would like you to do that for your second activity of the week and I look forward to seeing what you come up with and have fun